everybody. This is Melanie, your recreation therapist. I am calling to you today with my horse, Pixel. It is Friday, April 24th. All right, it's a beautiful day out today. We're finally hitting spring. They've been saying April showers bring May flowers. So I'm hoping that we have a lot of flowers come May. Um, like I said, beside me is my horse, Pixel. I have had her since she was six years old and she just turned 20 on April 12th. She has been my partner in crime throughout all of it. Pixel is called a quarter horse, that is her breed. So no, she did not race on the racetrack, but she is pretty fast. Pixel is a little bit smaller than your average racehorse, and she likes to play with cows. That's her big thing that she likes to do with me. I'm gonna give you a little bit of a video on a horse's confirmation. So of course we have the typical parts that you guys would think of, right? So we have her head and we have her muzzle and her ears, but in between her ears is called the pole, which is the top of her spine. Her spine runs, her spine runs all the way back and actually ends in her tail. Okay, so her tail is a part of her spine. There's a bone that goes all the way down into that tail so that when they swat for flies, they can use their spine to help them with that. A horse can feel the tiniest little fly on the back of them, which is so crazy to think that they allow us humans to get on them as well. This is your horse's tail, and as I promised, the horse's tail actually has a bone that goes all the way in. I am touching the bone right now, okay? So it goes all the way down to her spine, and her spine ends right here which is where all of the hair comes off of. Additionally, if you come down and look at her foot, okay, she has a horseshoe on. She actually has a corrective shoe on, which goes all the way around. Most horseshoes that you see are only gonna be right here. But with the horse, they have this little section in the middle and it's actually called the frog. I know that's a funny name for it, but it's called the frog. And that's kind of like your cuticle. So when you're cleaning this out, you don't actually touch this middle spot. You only clean around the outside. A cool thing about horses, depending on their breed, is that their names come and originate from different parts of their bloodlines. So for example, Pixel is really not her name. That's called her barn name. Her real name is Magic Eyed Belle. And the reason why she has that name is what they do is they combine their mom and dad's name to make a new one. So for example, her mom's name is Too Dry Belle and her dad's name is Magic's My Dad. So that's how she got Magic Eyed Belle. Thank you guys for joining me today. I hope you learned a little bit about horses. Pixel and I, uh, thank you for tuning in, and I hope to see you guys soon, happy and healthy. Okay. Pixel!